Y'all ever lie so good that y'all convince yourselves? Whenever I see homeless people, I love to give them whatever I can, you know, whatever they need, right? But here in Atlanta, they can get a little, you know, entitled or a little aggressive. So whenever I feel like uncomfortable around a homeless person, I always go to my usual, you know. Oh, look, man, I'm sorry. I don't got nothing on me right now. I got to support my kids at home. They kind of hungry. So after I finished telling old dude that, I went into the store and I'm subconsciously picking up crap that I originally did not come into the store for. I'm smiling at toys and shit. And you know, this one I realized, I grabbed a bag of Cheeto puffs and you know, kids love slopping down on some Cheetos puffs. And I go, oh yeah, they'll love these. And then it clicked. I don't got no damn kids. So after realizing that I'm picking up stuff for kids, kids that I don't have. I start walking around the store, putting all this stuff back, and I go back to the diaper aisle. Yes, I picked up some diapers, and when I get there, is uh, I'm putting the diapers back. There's a mom there, and she's like, oh, yeah, that brand is terrible. This is the one I usually get for mine. Now I feel obligated to take her, her, her recommendation. So, you know, I get to the checkout line, and I'm thinking crack going to be sweet, and, you know, I'm, I was just going to buy the diapers, you know, be chill about it. The lady swiped the diapers and said $40. $40 for some, some diapers? Oh, nah, them kids would have to be shitty booty if I had some for real. So I looked at the cashier. I'm like, yeah, you could just take that off. I turn behind me. I turn around and it's the same mom who recommended me the diapers. So I'm looking at her like, oh, thank you so much, ma'am, for your advice. My wife actually just texted me and she was like, she already picked some up for our daughter. So now she asked me questions about my kids and my wife. So I am now a father of two kids. One name Isabella, the other name Susie. And I, I really miss my kids for real, man. I ain't seen them in imaginary years.